did it. Oh, there it goes. Hey, we just learned. Hi there. We just learned something new uh, in recording. Our granddaughter taught us that if you hold the palm of your hand up in front of the camera, it will automatically activate. So we did that by accident, actually. We were going to do it, and Angie waved to you, and it took off. So Hi. Don't, don't turn it off. It's a, it, I don't think it turns it off just we'll on. Have to, it's a, so this is what happens when boomers get new products, right? So that's, this is it. But thanks, Allie, for the Thanks, tip. Allie. Thanks, anybody. Uh, so, hey, Thursday night. Last yes. time it was cold and cloudy. Yeah. So it was over 80 and sunny. The beautiful maple trees changed in colors. It's so nice outside. It is so pretty. So, how are you? I'm good. How, how are, you? are you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm a little bit, I always get a little bit nervous about these things. Yes. But then I always get kind of an adrenaline rush and get kind of a buzz you know, doing it. It's kind of fun just talking to our friends and. It is. It is, and we had a good week. We had a we had a a nice time. So I'm I'm excited. Uh, big news this week. Has this ever happened before? What the the two day sale? I don't know. I we're kind of new, so I'm not sure. We're noobs. First time for us. <laughs> First time for us. So big news this weekend is at Vintage Marketplace. Where is it? Uh, in Fort Collins, on the corner of Trilby and College. And this week they are having a two day sale. Right. And what they're calling a vendor clean out, which is kind of a vendor yard sale outside the building. It is exactly a yard sale, yes. It's a yard sale. So mm -hmm. there'll be people set up outside the building on mm -hmm. Friday uh, and they'll be selling off things. You'll deal directly with them. I would imagine that's cash mostly. Uh, I would bring cash. I would bring cash, but they probably can accept Venmo, a lot of them anyway. Oops. Oh, that was loud. Wow. New Sorry. Mistake so bad. Sorry. Everybody's going. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, so, vendor clean out, which is basically a yard sale on Saturday from 10 to 5, and then 10% yeah. off everything inside, all booths, at yes. least 10% off. Yes, up to 50% off. Some, some booths are marking their prices even lower. But yeah, I was telling Rick, um, the vendor clean out, um, you know, we, we go to estate sales and yard sales, and we just end up with a lot of stuff sometimes. So I bet there's going to be some really good stuff at some really good prices. So I think it's definitely worth checking out. That is 10 to 5 tomorrow. Tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And then 10 to 6 on Saturday is the regular sale, monthly mm -hmm. sale. And that is there will be actually booths set up outside again. Right. And booths inside. So yeah. That's what's happening. Mm -hmm. You okay? I am. Are you embarrassed? <laughs> A little embarrassed. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can tell you're embarrassed. <laughs> I'm like, that's two technology bloopers that I've done. What's the first one? I I started the video. That was amazing. <laughs> you're that's like a superpower. <laughs> It's like this. If you want to turn on your camera and you're doing this, you just go like Tony Stark and it'll turn on <laughs> by itself. But we weren't prepared. So you kind of caught us. Uh, we got some cool things. Mm -hmm. This thing is my favorite. I'm claiming it as a Rick's pick. You are? I am. Okay. We can go over it together if you want. I Yeah. This it can is be a, a Rick and Angie pick. This is for two people. Yes. And you guys can't see it yet, but I'm going to pick around. it up here for you. So um, go around. So this week we had a couple of friends um, give us some items for our booth, which is awesome. Thank you, Lori. Thank you, Kristen. And um, Lori, this was from Lori. And um, I don't know. You've probably seen these pictures before. I remember growing up seeing them. They're they're kind of cool vintage pictures. It was a little a little faded, just because um, it's older. And um, there's a trend that I've been kind of wanting to try. It's called. What is it called? Enhanced painting. Yeah, but it was like ghost ghost painting or something like that. So um, a lot of people are, they'll get a picture from Goodwill or from a thrift store and they just add little ghosts to it. So I just kind of spooky this one up a little bit. I'm not much of a spooky person, but I thought this was kind of Kind of a little bit fun. So Rick's going to point some of the okay. you got, things on out. On the red barn, you got keep out with some cobwebs up in the corner mm -hmm. over here. 
cobwebs over here and then this old ghost lady right here <laughs> kind of a crow up here on the mailbox some ghosts just walking down the country road some spiders here added to the pumpkins kind of an owl <laughs> up over here and some some webs kind of a swamp creature in here some kind of spooky eyes over here mm -hmm. and then she painted the whole frame it was distressed before and uh, she painted it kind of orange. So this one here is the axe. I think that one's kind of creepy. It's already, already. spooky, yeah. Yeah, and this I one's got some bats in it. A little creepy over here. And then there's a cute little ghost on a swing over yeah. here. So uh, <laughs> that's really cool. Kind of a fun trend. I've yeah. seen this trend before. My friends have a picture of the Denver skyline. Is that what it's called? Skyline? Mm -hmm. And they have like a little King Kong climbing one of oh. the Oh, I've never and, seen that. I love that. Yeah, it's kind of fun. And they got, you know, <laughs> weird things, a blimp going by and things. But anyway. <laughs> yeah. The picture is called Ghost Painting, New Trend. Uh, and uh, Angie painted this today. And it's going to be $14.99. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, I wanted to say, um, the last couple of weeks we've been selling things. People have been texting us and saying, hey, don't take it to the booth. I want to buy it. <laughs> right. Uh, if you do that, if you see something and you don't want it to go to the booth tomorrow, let us know. Yeah. Uh, we will hold it out for you and get it to you this week. But $14.99 for the ghost painting, uh, kind of a trending deal. The sooner you buy it, the more you should get out of it this year. <laughs> right. Yeah, I know. I'm of... a little late to the party. <laughs> ah, we have 14 bucks. What a fun thing, right? Yes. I think that's cool. Uh, what else do you want to go first? Or you want me to go first? Um, why don't you go ahead and go first? Ladies first. You want to go back and forth? We could do that. Sure. Okay. Why don't you do something? Okay. Well, um, so I wanted to show you these cute little jadeite um, teacups. They're, it's for my little children's um, tea set. So there's a saucer and a cup. They're in excellent condition, like absolutely remarkable. Um, and there's a set of four. I priced them individually. So a cup and a saucer is $4.99. And, um, and then there are also some little plates just separately. Um, there's like little cake plates or something? Is that, you know, what that is? Is that for a tea party? I, I think these are still for children, although um, these would... Oh, that's what I meant, like a cake plate for your tea party. Yeah, yeah. It could be a little cake plate. But, you know, I mean, we like to put vitamins on little dishes like this. And I don't know. You could put... Uh, you could set it... I, love I don't you know, so just much. for decor. I, I love just you so much. Jadeite is cool, right? So, um, and these are beautiful, also in really good condition. This one has a really neat pattern on it. I don't know if you can see that. This one's shape is just really pretty. And then um, th this one has that ridging along the edges. I don't know if you can see that, but anyway. Um, the individual plates, the larger ones, are $1.99, and the smaller ones are $1.50, and just a pretty thing. I just like how excited you get when you talk about jadeite. You know, jadeite really is cool. And you know what? And it's, it's expensive. Is it? It really is. It's Real pretty. jadeite is expensive. It's pretty. So these are a very good deal. It makes a nice noise when it tings together. It does. And so, oh, there it is. <laughs> Next thing, my turn. We'll trade back and forth. We've okay. got to go fast. We're almost I nine know. minutes. This piece here, our friend gave to us uh, to sell in the in the shop. Mm -hmm. um, it's kind of cool. It's beaded wire, kind of got a boho yeah. kind, of, kind of a thing to it. We have it in the sunlight up on a white wall and these red beads right here and these kind of, what color would you call that? Um, they're a little less red maybe a little more pink but i think it's it would be a good christmas decoration oh, too. like nice. it's, oh, it's yeah. very pretty yeah very nice very nice all the so red i'm a i'm a I'm kind of a hippie at heart and uh this thing here <laughs> kind of just calls to me and this is 9.99 it's called a jeweled wall decor that's what angie named it uh, i think it would be good for christmas as mm -hmm. well uh yeah. thank you again Lori. that's awesome thank you uh going into the booth tomorrow yes you want to go next yeah another another item that was given to us this week these are from Kristen. thank you Kristen. those are cool how sweet are these little baby shoes 
Oh my goodness. They are so sweet. I um, don't know how old they are, but they look little house on the prairie to me. I know. I I think these I think these could be late eighteen hundreds. They're they're I don't know if if there's a story behind them, but um these are nine ninety nine for this set of two shoes and They're real baby shoes all leather yeah you can tell they nice were patina. worn yeah one yeah. but there is a button missing on one of the shoes but they're beautiful i don't recommend them to wear on a baby <laughs> i wouldn't do that i would just use them for decoration very cute so there's things that people collect mm -hmm. like if you have some old tupperware mm -hmm. that's probably worth something right um if you have old Avon bottles. That's probably worth something. So right. friend, we have this one here. It is an old Avon uh, bottle. It is the Liberty Bell. Still has all the cologne in it. I didn't open it to smell it. Is each one of these a different smell? Or is there just... I think of, so. Is it? I, yeah, don't I, don't, I don't really know. Uh, vintage Avon decanter. Ooh. Uh, $5.99. So mm -hmm. uh, this is uh, an extreme collectible. People really like these things. Mm -hmm. um, we see them from time to time. Uh, people get a little goo goo for them. So uh, <laughs> if you are a patriot and goo goo for collectibles, uh, mm -hmm. Avon, there you go. Yeah. Uh, Five ninety nine, I think I said. Five ninety nine. You got one more. I do. I with, this one's been in the booth for a little while, and I don't know why it hasn't been bought. It seems like a good Halloween kind of thing. Halloween, or I don't know, I would probably put this on a bookcase. Like, mm. I think this is so cool. It's, owls are kind of hip, too. Yeah, it's the owl, he's the sitting on a couple of books, and That's he heavy. is super heavy, yes. And you call them weapon grade. Yeah, like if you had an intruder in your house. <laughs> Beware <laughs> intruder, she has an owl, and she's not afraid to use it. <laughs> but I just, I think it's beautiful. It's in very good shape. I think um, he's standing on books. He is standing on books. Okay. So that's why I would put him on a bookshelf because oh, okay. I think he's kind of cool. Um, and he is nineteen ninety nine. Uh, it's heavy. It's super and that, heavy. At nineteen ninety nine, that's about ten dollars a pound because that thing's heavy. <laughs> that's a yes, nine ninety nine pound. <laughs> Last thing. And and maybe one of my favorite things, Rick's picks. Mm. Uh, Angie painted this and then distressed it back. So, mm -hmm. what color is this, dear? Crinoline. Crinoline is mm -hmm. the color. So it's a little uh, um, like an antique white color. Antique white, rub through, nice round candle. Mm -hmm. Pretty heavy, not as heavy as the owl. A uh, hand painted candle with holder and candle, twelve ninety nine. So this. I think that's such a cool candle. I love the round candle. It's very fun, candle. huh? About the size yes. of a small softball. Small softball. <laughs> anyway, uh, mm. uh, sale this weekend. Yes. It's going to be a fun week next week. Our Aunt Arlene is coming to town. I know. Hi, Aunt Arlene. Hi, You're Aunt with Aunt Jessica. Arlene. Jessica bought the, the squirrel pictures. She did. We shipped them out this week. Yes. So, uh, that's another one, right? We, mm -hmm. did the, we did that. We did the soaps. Kevin bought the... Kevin gets a shout out because Kevin bought the Fox picture that I worked on last week. And then he, he texted me and this is international sign for text. <laughs> uh, and then he said, Hey, I want to buy that. Don't put it in the booth. And he paid me for it. And then he gave it back to me, asked me to sign it and put zero zero one on it. Uh, so that I would always have the first piece of art that I did. So thank you, Kevin. Pretty awesome. Super sweet. I was kind of jelly that his art sold before mine. Well, you know. <laughs> so, I really did hear about that. Like, that's a that's a thing. It is, that's it's a thing. true. I painted all of the nurses. You know, maybe we should have you paint a ghost picture. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> so anyway, uh, thank you guys as as per usual, yeah, thank you. Uh, we really appreciate it. Enjoy the interactions uh, on Thursdays now at work. People go Rick's picks, Daniel, uh, <laughs> or, or they they comment, or we, is a video going up? Uh, so uh, it's fun. I wanted to tell you guys we have. Uh, was it two weeks ago? We were trying to break a hundred. Yeah, we have a hundred and eleven. So hundred and eleven followers. Hundred and eleven people are that's kind of hanging out with us on this thing. So. Uh, thank you so much. We love you guys. We'll try not to drop our microphone next time. <laughs> Oops. I don't know a fancy way to turn it off, so I'm going to have to get up and push oh, the button. Oh, okay. Good deal. But <laughs> while she's getting up to push the button the old-fashioned way, 
uh, from 10 to 5 tomorrow is the vendor clean out. 10 to 6 is 10% off both days, 10% off. And that's at a Vintage Marketplace in the corner of College and Trilby. Have a wonderful week. We love you. See you soon, Arlene.